This video looks at solving equations of the form a number to the power of x equals another number. Now we begin by looking at the graph of 3 to the power of x. Now if we work out 3 to the power of 0 the answer is 1. So the graph must pass through 1 on the y-axis. However, as x increases so the graph increases. However, as x decreases the graph tends towards the x-axis. So the graph looks something like this. That's called the exponential growth graph. So that's a sketch of y equals 3 to the power of x. And indeed any graph of the form a to the power of x, where a is bigger than 1, will look like this. Now, to solve this equation requires one important step, and that is the logarithm function. If I were to log both sides of this equation, then the following happens. So log 3 to the power of 5x minus 1 is log of 500,000. Now then, one of the main log rules is that if you've got log of a number to a power, and the power falls down next to the log. So this equation becomes 5x minus 1 in brackets log with the base log 3, and that will equal log of 500,000. So to rearrange this equation to get x equals, I begin by dividing by log 3. So 5x minus 1 equals log of 500,000 divided by log of 3. So we're almost there. If I now add 1 across the other side, I get 5x is equal to log 500,000 over log of 3 plus 1. So to get x... I must divide all of this by 5. So if I get my calculator out, I will do log 500,000 divided by log of 3. Press enter. Add 1, then divide by 5, 2.6 to 1 dp. So x equals 2.6 to one decimal place. 